say and spell your name. Okay, um, so my name is Maritza Iturbid, M-A-R-I-T-Z-A, I-T-U-R-B-I-D. Okay. So, um, I was getting home from work when I seen, like, a lot of cop cars, and they were blocking off roads. And it was scary to see that, and also on my way home, I had seen, like, a lot of the smoke, and it was scary. Like, I wanted to cry because... It was scary because they kept saying that an explosion could have happened, but thankfully nothing happened and uh, our neighborhood is okay and they got everything under control. And well, we are fine now and that's all that happened. I was just mostly scared that... Did you go to a hotel? Did you have to leave? Yeah, we had to go to a hotel. Mm -hmm. Our family stayed there just like for one night. And how, how, how many are in your family that had to get a hotel room? To go? Uh, it was just like my my, me and my um, my brother and my sister-in-law and the baby because we were worried about the baby because of the smoke. But eventually my family returned back like, when like conditions were permitted. And well, yeah. Mm -hmm. Was it scary? It was scary. I wanted to cry because I was just getting home from work that night and I did not know what was happening. My sister sent me a text message. And it was just really scared to see all the smoke and, and the, the smoke was like, you could like smell, it smelled really bad. And well, yeah, a lot of roads were blocked off. They wouldn't let you go in unless you live in the actual zone area to help you evacuate. And actually took my dogs with me too. And I was scared for my dogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How did you find out about the evacuation? Were you told to evacuate? The, some people, like, they, they had, in our neighborhood, they were walking out. Like, some police um, went to the doors of other people to knock, to tell them to get out the neighborhood because possibly an explosion could have happened there. And there was, like, a, one lady who, her, her grandma was, like, 70, 78 years old and they said police had to come and get her because we seen her walking on our street right in front and police had to get her out and out of the neighborhood yeah <laughs> okay thank you very much